Welcome to a ViewSonic unboxing. My name is Ray and today I have for you this massive VX4381 4K. It is the largest monitor that we sell. It's the largest monitor in the VX lineup and I think you're really gonna like it because this combines a lot of what you would want from a small television with the sharpness and precision you would expect of a 4K monitor and it does kind of both pretty well. So let's get this open and see what you get in the box. Drop it down. Okay, getting to the enormous innards of this box, it's, it's like a small bed. Uh, we have all the components we're gonna need to kind of form this, this monitor. So you can start to see just by the first piece, this is not your normal size monitor because this is just the, the foot for the stand that can support sort of the size and weight of the monitor, uh, quite a big piece, much bigger than I've seen on any of our other units. Next up, we have the upright piece of the monitor stand. This one is quite big. And uh, while we do try to make most of our installation on our monitors toolless, this one does require a little bit of tool work um, because we want this to be able to support uh, a bigger amount of weight. Uh, but we do include the screwdriver that, you'll, that you can use in here, but you can always use one that you have yourself. So first things first, we're actually going to attach our plate here, slide it right into our foot. It does lock into place, but you do want to fix that with the five included Phillips head screws. Bring this in. Now that we've got basically everything out of the box where you can start constructing our stand and kind of get the whole monitor assembled. But before we do that, I'd just like to indicate to you, we do include, of course, a power cable. Uh, we include USB that allows you to use the USB ports that are on this monitor. So if you want to connect, say, a keyboard or mouse to it, uh, you can actually then move that between any of the active ports on this monitor. And there's actually four HDMIs. So that gives you the ability to KVM switch between four different computers, which in in some use cases, you know, maybe you work in many different environments or you're a developer for different environments, you may want your monitor and your keyboard mouse to be able to use with all of those in a simple and easy way. And so part of the solution that this monitor is, is to provide that sort of easy KVM functionality. So important to point out the USB cable. Uh, we include an HDMI, full-size HDMI, most common connector that you're going to use. And uh, this is very TV-like in its size and uh, dimension. So perfect sense that we would have have uh, HDMI in there. We actually have also a mini display port on it. And since not a lot of people have mini display port cables, uh, we include a mini display port to full size display port. So you can connect it to just about any commercially available graphics card uh, if that's how you want to run it. Next up, let's get this stand assembled. So the stand, as I said, uh, does take some screws. This one has five silver screws that match this silver plate. Okay. So we have our base fully installed. So now the entire bottom half of the monitor is nice and assembled. Uh, what we want to do is get the bottom part of our monitor exposed a little bit so that we can connect the stand to it. And just as I'm doing, you can assemble this fully laying down flat. It can, you can tilt the stand up enough that it's not really putting weight on it. So it's not pushing it away from where you're trying to install it. it makes it nice and easy so that you can get this all out in one piece. Um, I would recommend that you do this with two people. Uh, I will pull it out on my own, uh, but it is relatively heavy and it is easy to drop it. So you may want to have a there, person there to help you get this out of the box. Okay. And now we can tip the whole thing up and then pull the protective cover off of it. All right. 
Now that we've got the VX4381 all set up, you can kind of see how big this screen is. It actually has uh, a bit of a semi-gloss to it. Uh, this is a VA panel, so it gives us really, really good um, native contrast. It helps with the black levels that you're seeing on the screen. Uh, but it also means that this is actually a very bright um, monitor. It can handle pretty bright environments with no issue because it, it's pushing more than 350 nits of brightness. Uh, and again, it's got four different digital inputs that you can use. So two of those are HDMI's, one of those is a mini display port, and then a full-size display port. Additionally, for connectivity, we also included a display port output that actually means that you can daisy chain this. So for example, you wanted to have two of these set up, you could then wire the connection output from the first one to the second one, as long as your display port is good enough to run two 4K signals, which some of them are. So that would give you an enormous amount of screen real estate to work with. And as I said before, any of those four inputs can actually be run not only as a KVM, but they can actually be run at the same time. So if you have, say, uh, four camera angles you're trying to get inside of a, a house because you're trying to you know, see where your cameras are set up, uh, this is a monitor that without any additional hardware can actually be used as a viewpoint for four different sources. Uh, and a lot of our customers actually have expressed to us an interest in these type of things for anything from uh, a, a train uh, operation center to an emergency response center because they do often need to be taking in video from many different sources and providing that to their employees. So this has just been a quick unboxing and overview of the VX4381-4K. Please watch this space for more exciting videos from ViewSonic.